Hello techies, welcome back to the channel. My name is Krishna and I am a big data tester and ETL data warehouse tester. So today we are going to continue on the solving of the SQL queries. Let's go to the screen and let's get started with the video. So in the previous videos we have covered how to install uh, SQL, how to install dbweaver and how to connect to database. So now we are continuing with the Oracle database and we have solved around 36 questions. Please watch the other videos in the playlist and then come to this video. And let's get started from the uh, question of uh, 36th question. Display the name from employees in order of salary that is name of employee. So the lowest salary should appear first. So, so before we start let me just give you a heads up on we are dealing with two tables that is one is uh, employee table okay and another table is select star from dept which is the department table so these two are the tables which we are working on so 36 question display the name of employees in order of salary that is the name of the employee earning lowest salary should appear first so select e name from emp Mm, we just want the uh, names right order order by mm, cell okay uh, so just to get the reference of what is their salary i'm just putting salary or column also so here we see employee name and salary so so the person who is getting the less salary has uh, come at the top and then king with the highest salary is at the uh, bottom if you don't assign anything if you don't uh, say that it should be sorted in um, ascending order or descending order so it will default by default it will take as ascending order so we can write asc this is when to uh, sort the details in ascending order and if you want them in descending order de sc so now the king comes on top okay so desc is for after writing the order by clause and writing the column name then you assign whether it should be ascending or descending if you don't assign as anything by default it will take as ascending so here we want any way ascending so i will not write anything and they have only asked for name so we'll just mention the names okay awesome let's go to the next question 37 Dis display the name of employee in descending order of salary so which we have already done uh, select e name from emp order by cell desc that is descending okay in case you want salary column for reference you can do this but in the query it is not asked i'm just writing for reference so that we can see the salary also display the names of the employees in order of employee name so select select e name from emp order of name that means order by which column should come e name that is the name so this is it comes in the order adams allen blake clark so a b c d e f like this will go in this flow and if you want uh, in descending order we'll just write desc so the word comes on top but here they are asking only order control enter uh, display emp number e name department number okay let's start select emp number e name dpt number yeah salary from emp sort the output first based on name and within name by department number and within department number by cell okay order by what is first e name comma dpt number within dpt number by cell okay so uh, just to explain this query so they are saying uh, sort first base on name so basically by e name we will sort and then after the e name is sorted inside e name sorted by department number e name it is sorted in this order within name by uh, base output first base on the name 
and written and within name by department number and within department number by cell sorting by name is a b c d it will come first and then department number so if a a so a a so uh, adams and allen they both are starting with a so a d comes first and then department number 20 comes first and then come 30 if you see adam is from 20 and allen is from 30 and in on top of that uh, uh, if both suppose adam and allen were from uh, department 20 then their salary which is a least salary adam is getting least salary which is 1100 rupees so uh, adam will come on top so basically first by name which will be alphabetical order a b c d if even the names are same on top of that will apply department number so whichever department number is lower that will come on top and if the department number is also same whichever salary is lower that will come on top so i hope you are getting what uh, so basically e name by name we are sorting on top of that by department number we are sorting so if a person has um, well, three four people have the same name then they will be sorted according to their department number and if they have the same name and the department number also is the same then it will be sorted according to their salary and then you can see the difference or now you may not be able to see the difference but this is how so basically when you say order by e name first it will sort by e name and then it will go sort according to department number and then it will go sort according to salary so let's go to the next query which is for to display the name name of the employee along with their annual salary that is salary into 100 the name of the employee earning highest annual salary should appear first okay select star no no select e name from emp mm, display employee name along with so we'll do sal into 12 okay as total sal if we do this we are getting smith and their salary i'll just write salary also so that you can differentiate here so if you see smith uh, salary is 800 800 into 12 is 9600 okay so this we got and uh, the name of the employee earning highest annual salary should appear first order by sal into 12 descending okay yes king is getting salary of 5000 per month so 12 into 5 becomes 60,000 so his salary is the highest so that's why we are getting a total sal which is 60,000 which is highest so that's how uh, is asked in the question the na name of the employee earning highest annual salary should appear first so king is getting the highest salary so king name should appear first so order by we are putting a calculation there so this is also allowed you can put a calculation in order by clause okay i hope this is helping and if you guys have not subscribed to the hindi channel please uh, subscribe to the hindi channel uh, the link is in the description box and i'll be uploading a sql uh, full throttle video uh, with uh, more than 50 queries in a single short video uh, this will be coming in this week for sure and uh, please subscribe to the hindi channel and i'll be uh, getting more videos on hindi channel also and please share this video with whomever uh, uh, you want them to be learning sql and whoever might be getting help from this video okay, let's go uh, to the next query display name salary hra pf da total salary for each employee the output should be in the order of total salary hra 10% of salary, DA 10% of salary, PF 5% of salary, total salary will be okay. This is good. E name, comma sal, HRA is what 15%. So 0.15. 15% mm -hmm. into sal, comma DA. Mm -hmm as what hmm. hra okay 10 percent right 0 0.10 into sal as what hmm. pf then five percent no ten percent of salary is da so this is da and then uh, five percent that is zero point zero five into sal as pf and total sal total sal let's put 
mm, all these and add all these in the place of comma I'll put plus and from EMP output show in the order of total salary okay order by I'll put this equation hmm. okay there is missing right parenthesis where is parenthesis this is open bracket this is close this is open this is close where else did I open a bracket okay so uh, here uh, we don't need as uh, so here we are putting alias name but here we don't need alias name because this is all calculation so yes now order by the total salary uh, oh yeah who is getting the minimum salary is on top so if you see here here 0.5 okay and if i just do it as uh, descending I'll get the highest salary on top so this is how you play around with uh, you know uh, arithmetic uh, operators and then uh, order by so let's go to the next one display department name and total number of employees working in each department okay we will stop here because this is a separate topic we will start aggregator functions Please comment aggregator functions or aggregation or put SQL, SQL, SQL type comment SQL so that I come up with more videos and uh, I hope you are liking this video and I hope you are enjoying how we are solving SQL queries. Uh, please comment SQL and please subscribe to the Hindi channel. I will be getting video in this week itself. So subscribe to the channel and watch the video in Hindi and if you if I get more comments on SQL I will make more videos and faster videos maybe I'll start making two videos in a week please comment SQL and give a thumbs up to this video this inspires me to make more videos so thank you for watching the video and subscribe to the channel and uh, please follow me on in LinkedIn and Instagram thank you for watching the video see you next week bye bye